Oh my god, it's cold. Can you hear me? <laughs> I seem to say this all the time. Can anybody hear me? Yes, no, yes, no. <laughs> Come on, say you can hear me. Can you hear me? Please say you can. Fellows. Yes. <laughs> Thank you, Kat. <laughs> oh. Right, have we done it? We've done it. I can hear you. You kept freezing. Oh, that's typical, isn't it? Right. This is the graveyard where I was on my own. And it was lovely and it was just around about here that I felt something going past my knees well past my legs it was really weird but there was just definitely something here and I think it was around about here it's one of the photos that I took so it's in Hampshire Chelsea can't really give out my exact spot <laughs> But yeah, this is where I was on my own. And it's just started to rain. How good is that? <laughs> oh, well, that's just typical, isn't it? We can sit in the camper van if it rains too much. I'll put my hood up. <laughs> oh, God. Didn't play with my hood. I was hoping to have a little play with the ovulus. Hopefully I still can. Good afternoon, Barry. <laughs> oh. Something really, really weird happened to me coming here. Um, I was driving the camper van. I haven't gone in it since driven it since yesterday um, I'm doing fine Barry thank you Brian sorry I'm doing fine thank you <laughs> yeah I haven't driven the camper van since yesterday and I went out obviously heading here and there was a massive bumblebee in the camper van so instead of panicking I pulled over put my hazards on let her out but then this car, well, no, it's not a car, this van, headed straight towards me on my side of the road. And then he swerved at last minute because he was looking at his mobile. And I'm thinking, my God, if I didn't stop to let this bumblebee out, he probably would have crashed into me because it was a small road as well. But... Ugh. Yeah, I do get these um things happen to me. It's weird. Really weird. But this is where, this is the graveyard I love to go to at night time on my own. It really is. Oh, thank you for the gifts, Chelsea, but you really don't have to, honestly. I'd rather you tap, tap, tap the screen. <laughs> it is a beautiful place, Gainer. Would you like me to um, point out any spirits if I see them again? 
because we did last time and that was a really I really enjoyed myself actually it is peaceful Brian it's very peaceful I do love coming here yeah okay because last time a few of you said oh my god no can't see it can't see it so okay we'll move to the next one and then I got oh my god I could see it keep my eyes out It is very interesting then. <laughs> I do love this place. I mean, look at that tree. Wow. Seriously. Mahusiv. Tree to the left. There's a man watching me. That wouldn't surprise me really wouldn't surprise me do you know somebody said to me when i was younger do you know you bring spirits out yeah okay <laughs> i think i closed down things happened to me when i was a kid and i, I just closed down but yeah i opened up again i couldn't resist and i love it I'll be doing this next Wednesday when I say goodbye to my brother and oh Brian, I'm so sorry. That tree there. <laughs> Do you know what? It's like I say to people, if you don't know who I am, have a look at all the screenshots that I take. Okay. Take three or four screenshots while I'm here. Alright. And then have a look at all the screenshots. You'd be surprised on what you can see. Brian, whenever I go to a family funeral or anything like that, it's it's horrible. Yes, it is. Um, but I always think to myself, that's that's not the person in in that coffin. That's not because that's just a body. That's what they've left. They're at, rest. they're at peace that's all I thought about with my dad at his funeral it's like no he's not there he's he's gone already oh Gaynor you've got the eye haven't you <laughs> Chelsea you can think like that <laughs> Chelsea, you can think like that. Honestly, I can hear footsteps behind me. Oh my, this is the spot. It was just about here. I'm not alone again. <laughs> um, yep, here we go. It was just about here. If you go onto my um, TikTok page, you'll see that I've got a couple pinned. Um, you need to look at the nighttime one with the gravestone in it. Okay, just listen to that because it's this spot where I heard a woman's voice. It was like, ah, like that. It was amazing. And it was alive, obviously. It was about 10 o'clock at night. I was stood here on my own trying to catch something. And, yeah, a lot of people on the live heard it. They all said, oh, my God, spooky, we can hear that. <laughs> <laughs> Do 
It's here again. To the lady that was here the other night, do you think you can make a noise again? Make a sound? We're not here to hurt you, we just want some confirmation. Sorry, let me turn some notifications off if I can. There you go. Right, off. I can hear something. <laughs> okay, right. I've got something here. Sorry about the noise. Bear with me. <coughs> right, if anyone wants to see any lives that I do as well, any repeats on them, if you go onto my TikTok page, just below my profile picture, you'll see um, a little icon for YouTube. Click on that and subscribe. It's all for free. And I download all of my lives on there. So, this is my Ovilus I've just turned on. Um, I've just got to try and remember which one it is. Here we go. It tells me if there's a spirit near me. So it looks like there's one to my right. Keeps freezing. No! Hi, Julie! That is weird that it keeps freezing because I've never had any problems in this section before. Oh wow, look. When it spikes out like that, it means that there's something around me. That's a tr oh yes, Gaynor. Have a have a look at them all, honestly. This is just weird. If you hear voices now, that's two workmen in the background. Thinking, what a mad cow. <laughs> Oh, we've done it again. I turned it off. Damn it. Right, let's get some voices. Right. Scratch. Data. It's freezing when you go near that tree. I always have problems whenever I'm near a spirit, which is a pain. I can see one, but I don't know if anyone else can. Okay. Just there. Yes, Gaina, it is. It's definitely the energy around. There's a little face there. That's a busy little spot. Just there. Can you see the little face? Go on, move.
Farmers shouted and wish. Oh my God, this is busy today. You can see the face get, oh, brilliant. It's always nice when someone I don't know. Right, I'm gonna go down in this section because my latest two screenshots I put up yesterday, I was looking through here. You know something about this graveyard. Just love. Wow! Hello from Texas. <laughs> Recan Pixie. Look at this. You got two trees. What a little face there. Two trees, and you just walk through them. Here is where I always pick up the lady around you. She's very confused, maybe dementia. She has a long night dress on. Oh, bless. Right, I can see some faces forming. Please look in between these. All right, it's out of focus because of my finger. Look in between these. Please tell me they're still there. Yes, they are. Keep staring. The one to the right of, you've got the three headstones, well where I pointed, the one to the right of that headstone, the face is coming through really clearly. Can you see it? I'm going to be taking screenshots there, definitely, because I can see a face. It's a man with a beard. You can see a big moustache as well. Hello, sir. I can see you. Hi from Greece. Oh my God. Hello dolls from Greece. Oh, amazing. Where are we all from? I can see a small boy there. Yes, there was something there. Um, again, if you have a look at the screenshots, it's the last two I put up there. Oh, hello. Oh, I'm sorry if everyone's looking, but West Yorkshire, Santorini. <gasps> What the? Oh, I think that's a bird. That face is still there. I don't believe it. Normally, if I disappear, it's it's it goes. Oh my God! It's it's there. Oh, I'd love to live on an island closest we got for an island. We've got two actually. You've got the Isle of Wight and Hailing Island. <laughs> Do you know it's freezing today? It's like winter suddenly come back. It really is. I can still see his face. Can nobody see it? He's still there, bless him. There's another one. Right, hang on, I'm trying to get my finger in the lens so you can see it. There. Little one round the corner. You heard footsteps behind me, Gaynor. Oh, wow. Do you know what? I am gutted. Um, oh, when was it? Last week. 
um, I'd done a live and I was walking around the graveyard and just as I was going to leave, it started to get dark and I saw a couple of spirits by a gate. So I was looking and everyone's saying, oh my God, I can see them move, I can see them. And everyone was like shocked that they could see it. So, <coughs> excuse me, with that, I could hear footsteps, like little footsteps running and some children's voices. It's like, oh, okay, I'm by the children's section. I know I am. But obviously, I wouldn't be called around there. So um, I went in, inside the graveyard, managed to find a torch in the camper van, went in the graveyard. Um, it was really dark by then. And I don't know, it felt like I was getting followed around, but they didn't want to talk. But I can't put it up because it's lagging. I can hear the voices. I can hear the footsteps. I can actually hear a horse running, galloping as well. And there weren't only horses there. Um, yeah, but I can't put it up. I got kicked off then. Oh, no, Gainer! <laughs> but yeah, I can't put it up because it was lagging too badly. Where I'm saying, can you hear the voices? The camera's still, but I'm walking. That's how badly it was lagging. So I'm still looking out. Obviously, this it seems to be this. These headstones are very popular. But no, I, I do love doing what I do. Oh, look. Thank you for your service. Hi, Sunflower. Okay. Hi, Caterpillar. Oh, I'm good, thank you. I've been kicking myself up the butt. <laughs> Bit of anxiety. So I thought, right, I'm not going to have this anymore. So I got on the running machine, quick shower, and now I'm out. There was someone by the tree. Boss girl. What tree? You mean over there? <gasps> Game out, yes, yes. That was that was dark, and last time I heard that was about two years ago. Is that the one that you're on about? Because that was amazing. I don't think they were galloping. It sounded to me it sounded like they were trotting like through the graveyard. It was fantastic. Honestly, I I loved every minute of that live from Deborah Davies. Yeah, definitely. Now this part here is, it was just round about here, you've got two faces. Good afternoon, Cathy. <laughs> I picked up, <coughs> excuse me, I picked up on two faces and it was a man and a woman and it's clear as anything and it's on one of my screenshots on my TikTok, but I do apologise, it's probably quite a few back because I've got quite a few screenshots on there. It is, it's in Cheshire, isn't it? We've got ducks here. <laughs> We're nowhere near water. <laughs> We've got ducks. <laughs> Actually, we are near a little bit of water. We're near a lake. Let's have a little walk. Excuse me? I just heard something. Does anyone want to say anything? Hello, is anybody there? Signal keeps dropping. This is a pain in the bum. <coughs> How about now? Oh, why does the signal have to drop? Oh, 
I'm in the UK. I'm in Hampshire. And I've got a little bit of a soreness at the front of my head, on my forehead, which normally means there's something about. It normally means it's not too nice as well. Am I back in the room? So sorry about that, everyone. Normally we've got no problems with signal around here. <coughs> but I believe um, that tree to your left is the first one. go back there um, yeah I believe if you keep on returning to a certain cemetery or graveyard or a place where you know that there's spirits you sort of like it sounds no why do I say it sounds daft you sort of like get associated with them they get used to you being around hi Dars why do you like walking around graveyards they're relaxing they're peaceful <laughs> there's loads it's like just listen can you hear the birds it's lovely and I, I love walking around the graveyards I really do spirits are there yes they are <laughs> you've got good spirits you've got horrible spirits Oh, you're a medium. Hi, yeah. I think if we walk around this part, oh, you're going to see a train. <laughs> Can you see it? <coughs> <coughs> oh, evil ones to be careful. Yes. Um, if I walk around this part, we might freeze. Should I give it a go or not? Do you want me to walk around right at the end? I don't know whether to or not. Can you hear me now okay? Light the light. If for any reason you need to rest or sleep outside for any reason, it's the best place to be. Do you think? Do you know what? I first started going around graveyards because people used to say, oh, oh my God, you can see spirits, so why don't you go around some graveyards and see? And I went, yeah, okay. And um, so with that, sorry, it's like I'm trying to read as well. <coughs> so I thought, okay. And then I thought, Do you know what? I'm going to take some screenshots and hopefully people can see what I can see. So, with that, um, that's how it just started. The signal's better now. Oh, brilliant. I've not been on my own. Mum and Dad's grave in ages. Because I can't go up there on my own. And I wouldn't anyway. Oh, bless you. Everybody's different. And do you know what? It's like, I wouldn't go up near any graves that are young anyway. <laughs> Best dream. No, seriously, you've got all the younger graves up here in that section. Um, I'm pretty sure you've got some here. Within like, even like 50 years, no way would I go up there. Because I don't, I don't think it's right. And I, I think it's like, I don't know. In England, we find it like a little bit like disrespectful kind of thing. Well, I do. I'm getting a feeling that you're being watched under the trees. <laughs> that wouldn't surprise me. Let's turn this on, see if we get anything at all. Let's go for the ABC. Seat. Does anyone, anyone here want to tell me their name?
savvy person. Okay. <coughs> Is there anyone here that wishes to communicate with me? I can see a spirit there. I can see his face. Keep staring. It's coming through a lot darker now. Darker, a lot stronger, sorry. Oh, I'm not sure about that one. No, I'd rather not. <coughs> yep, but there's definitely there. <coughs> and it's, oh, it's changed and it's coming through again. There you go, can you see? This is wrong. Oh, did you? I'm sorry that you feel that way. But if you don't like it, don't watch it. All right? I'm not being funny, but just don't watch it. <coughs> yeah, keep looking. There. <coughs> I understand in a way, Digit, where you're coming from, but if I was going around jungle graves and people that have just been buried and everything, that's definitely wrong. But I only go around the older graves, older sections, and places that may have a spirit or two. <laughs> Aren't you scared? No, I'm not. Do you know, it's the living that scare me, not the dead. I'll be more nervous walking through here if there was a man walking down here. Oh, even a woman. I'll be, I'll be more nervous. <coughs> Honestly. I do a lot of walks in graveyards at night time as well. Yeah, I do see spirits. <laughs> you too. <laughs> <laughs> Julie, you're damn right. <laughs> it is. Oh. I heard something there. Oh, there's one. I can't even see what there. There. Shouldn't be scared of the dead. It's the living you want to be scared of. There you go. <coughs> Boss girl, can you see it? Can you see the spirit stood there? It's coming through a lot clearer now. Even more frightening at night. No, it's not. <coughs> it's portrayed as being frightening. But it's, oh my God, it's coming through a lot clearer. I think it's a little girl. There. It's portrayed as being scary because it's dark and you can't see what's around you. <coughs> Dean, if, if that's the way you feel, then why are you watching? <coughs> oh, it's so lovely. I have three in my house. Oh, wow. No, I love doing this. Honestly, this, oh, unholy, make and fresh. He isn't now. <laughs> Julie. Oh, I can hear something big time. I've got a feeling a train's going to go past. <coughs> I've done it before, actually, 11 o'clock at night, coming around here at night time. 
and then you hear a train. That is quite freaky. How comes there no nine elves around? Oh, there's no one else around. Don't know, but there isn't. <laughs> oh, hang on. There you go. <laughs> Can you imagine it? 11 o'clock at night, and you get that. Please read some tombstones. <clears throat> of course I can. I'm so sorry. I was busy looking for spirits. <laughs> some of these you can't because it's like, because we're in the old section, it's difficult to see some. <clears throat> Let's see what we can see. Oh my God. Late bomb. R-H-A. Kill, oh my god, killed in action at Villa's Bestone, the 4th of April, 1918, aged 28, his duty done. Oh my god, oh sweetheart, thank you so much for your... Oh wow. Yeah. <laughs> See, like this one, you can't even see. You've got the writing there, but you can't see it. Just there. Uh... <clears throat> Bad service. Oh, I thought it would be me coming down this way. This is why I don't go near any younger graves. Do you know what? It's like, I haven't done a live where people are talking about long, younger graves for ages. <laughs> You're right, Doz. They are historical and interesting. People's stories are interesting, especially old tombstones. Yes, they are, definitely. And while we're here, actually, we have uh, we have a new moderator, which is Doz. <laughs> so yeah, welcome to the family, Doz. <laughs> That's fair enough. But each their own. It's another one. Is that's why I wouldn't go in a crematorium. Yeah, you've got all the older ashes there, I suppose, if you want to put it that way. But then you've got the younger ones. I could never go to a crematorium because of that. General people who walk past read them too. Yes, they do. <laughs> oh, Dos, <laughs> you're welcome. <laughs> if anything, it's nice because it's like. This is like a little bit of confirmation that there is something after death as well, which is lovely. It's what they're there for to be remembered. Oh, Jeff, yes. I couldn't have said that any better. Well done, yes. It is, definitely. My dad doesn't have um, a headstone bless him um he's his ashes are actually with my grandparents so he's with his family he's with yeah and if there was a headstone i don't know i think i might be upset now because he only died bless him 10 years ago but it's like if you saw like my grandparents i think i'd be all right with that but yeah they're there to be remembered What's the point of having details on a headstone if you're not going to look at them? Oh, Paige. Paige, yes, you're right. <laughs> there you go, another twirl there. 
<coughs> and these you can't even see. But <coughs> what I do say to people is if you can't see the headstone properly, and it, say if it is a little bit darker, then get the torch and hold it downwards, okay, over the writing. And you can actually see the writing better. I'm going to walk in between, I'm not walking on. See, you can't even see that. Died the 27th of May. It's Caroline Whitting. Whiting. Sorry, I can't see that. No. Isn't there a pri pirate's one in the back of Warbington? I remember. <laughs> uh, do you know what? I think there is. I need to find that one. There's that one as well. It's like some of them you can't even acknowledge this one you can't either might be if you take a screenshot there's a massive story about that my friend's nan owns the house oh wow oh oh wow the king that cut off his wife's head i thought oh <laughs> But yeah, if you want to see what I do, it's in the Havoc Museum. Oh, you're a regular, a lo regular, a local, sorry. But if you want to see what I do, have a look at my TikTok page, all right? And have a look at all the screenshots. If you can't see anything in one, go to the next one and have a look. I must visit Haven't Museum. <laughs> Honestly, it's, it's so worth just having a look. Why is that going funny? Look at that. It must be the sun. Look at that. <laughs> I know what it is. It's because the light's coming through all this. <clears throat> Woohoo. Look at that. Now that is sad. Do you walk in the in the night by Grace? Yes, I do. I love it. I find it peaceful. I don't find it scary. <clears throat> I think people only find it scary because they can't see around them. But I prefer to walk around a graveyard during the day than at night. For the simple fact is I can get better screenshots at night time. You can't see much. I swear people just want me to go around the graveyard at night time hoping that I'll get scared. <laughs> <coughs> One thing, if you're going around a night and um, doing a night time walk around the graveyard, if anything scares you, do not run. You're giving out more energy to whatever is around you. So do not run and stand your ground. Don't run from what? Have you ever gone round a graveyard at night time, Matt? <laughs> Have you ever heard anything? I wonder about if people get paranoid. It's like, oh my God, what's that? <gasps> you know, we're in a graveyard. It's dark. Let's run. That's not a good thing. Nothing ever happens. That's because you don't open up. Don't be one of them. <laughs> Just because you can't see it, it doesn't mean it's not there. Hi, Craig. <laughs> I can see one there. Only a little one. Just there. <clears throat> How do I open up? Relax more. Listen to, like, relaxing music. <laughs> 
seriously, just because you can't see it, it doesn't mean it's not there. I mean, a lot of it you can debunk. I don't know if you can see all the lights. Can you see lights flickering there? For that, that's just the sunlight coming through all, all the twigs and everything. It's very true, yeah. It doesn't mean... It is there. You're right. It's like people say to me about pareidolia. Um, I don't know if you've heard about um, the word pareidolia. Hi, oh, yeah. <laughs> um... I believe when I see it, not beforehand, that's mad. No, believe when you see it. Right. Parado oh. Paradolia is. Do you know when you was a kid and you used to look up at the sky and you used to see like, oh my God, that looks like a rabbit. Well, that looks like a dog. Just look at the clouds. That's paradolia. So all the screenshots that I take, I can't say 100% if they're paradolia or if they're real. No one. Yes, it's mad to believe something before every evidence. Matt, you're damn right. It is. But a lot of people, it's like... No, I, I do. I, I really agree with you there, honestly. But I think some screenshots there would be good. Especially there. keeps freezing again it's up in this section isn't it this isn't fair <clears throat> i'll tell you what should we sit in the camper van where it's nice and cool um cool warmer what's wrong with saying I don't know what it is, rather than saying paranormal. What? Because I believe in paranormal, and you don't, so you'll say you don't know what it is, and I'll say, oh, it could be paranormal. <laughs> oh, that, that sounds perfect, honestly. Look at that. Someone decides to drive past and then um, drive away. Isn't that nice of them? <clears throat> oh, I am freezing. I'm sorry, but... Oh, my... God, I am so cold. <clears throat> <clears throat> oh, sorry. I'm a bit chilly here. <sighs> I'd love to go around a bit more, but honest to God, it's it's freezing cold out there. It is. <sighs> oh, it's a massive. Couldn't get around the whole thing through so many paths. <gasps> I paid you right. It is down to him. It's weird weather at the moment. Oh, hi, Michael. <laughs> Um, yeah, it is weird. It's like, I think we're having our second winter coming through. I'm not sure. Nobody is right or wrong. You're right. You need some soup. Oh, yeah. Do you know what? I love um, leek and potato soup, but I can't stand eating leeks. Where's that come from? Has anyone else got anything weird like that? I love oranges. I'll have a couple of oranges every day. I'm terrible like that. But I can't stand orange creams. I love coffee. But I can't stand coffee cringes every day. I'm terrible like that. But I can't stand orange creams. I love coffee. But I can't stand coffee cream. Ask, could you walk with them past the cemetery? There was, they kept saying, oh my God, they were scared. I've been detecting it on an old site near. Kit's coat, Coty and Ken. Oh, well, let, let me know if you're on your own and you want some company. <laughs> oh, hang on a minute. So, 
sorry. <coughs> right, I'll stick you up here. Yeah. <laughs> and they're back in the room. <laughs> yeah, it's really weird here today, isn't it? <laughs> I was same when I was alive. When I was alive, how? How sorry when I said I was the same when I was alive. Oh, Jeff, so you're not here? <laughs> I can't stand coffee. Revels. Oh. <laughs> Uh, do you know what I love? I love the Revels, as in the peanut ones and the raisin ones. I'll give them a good suck and then I'll spit spit the others out. Coffee, oh yeah, black no sugar. <coughs> if anyone's got any coffee available, that'd be lovely. Just put my jacket away. Oh God. Oh, actually, while we're on the subject, okay, um, I've got something. I uh, well, I do have anxiety, and I do have a couple of issues. I have for the last couple of days, right? But if anybody wants like a spinning ring, I spin mine like mad, and I play with it all the time when I'm going out, even on a live. And they got home a lot faster. Oh my god, Jeff, that's so funny. I understand now. Yeah, so. If you contact Julie on here, her daughter sells spinning rings. Not this one, but other ones. And they're really nice. No, I'm alive. That's all right, then. <laughs> I wonder what you were getting at, Jeff. I'm so sorry. <laughs> uh, right. Um, has everyone, is everyone going to sign up on my YouTube? Because I want to get that going. Big time. I am going to stay on TikTok. I'm not going to leave TikTok. I do love TikTok, but I can only do like 10 minutes at a time on TikTok for like recordings. And when I do a live, I can't even upload it on to TikTok. <laughs> I don't know why people get freaked out. So what's that? Michael, what do you mean what's that? What, what a spinning ring is. It's for anxiety. I'm playing with mine now. I like to have a little fiddle. That sounds wrong, doesn't it? <laughs> Oops. <sighs> Watch your YouTube. Um, if you go onto my um, my TikTok page, just below my profile picture, you'll see. Uh, <laughs> sorry, <coughs> you'll see a little icon for YouTube. So if you click on that, okay, and it'll take you straight to my YouTube. It's Spooky Walks Portsmouth six seven three eight something like that but i know it's spooky walks portsmouth they added on the numbers <coughs> i get a max of an hour and 20 minutes recording what's that what that you can i don't understand is that for your lives or something That you, <coughs> that you can download. No, no, you can do more than that. I've downloaded, I've got some on there from that haunted hotel for like two hours and 40 minutes. <coughs> I, oh, does, no. I've tried clicking on it. It's not doing anything. Oh, bum. Yeah, no, it's Spooky Walks Portsmouth. If you, if you plug in Spooky Walks Portsmouth, you'll see my mad face. I'm there in a blue blouse going... <laughs> Oh, Charles, hope you feel better soon. <coughs> oh, that was freaky. That came up sometimes, Julie. Oh, dear me. Yeah, so please just have a look on... Sorry, you can actually see me having a little having a little fiddle now. It's nice to have a little fiddle, you know. It's always good to have a fiddle. Yeah, <coughs> have a look on the YouTube. Just look up Spooky Walks Portsmouth and, yeah... You'll see all my lives, all the haunted hotels. Um, hopefully, I'm going to um, a football stadium soon. And um, 
that's going to be a good one i hope because there's a few regulars at the local pub that was part, that's part of it um have passed on and they actually they, they swear blind everyone swears blind that they come back <coughs> um in june it's the end of june i'm going to york so i'm really really looking forward to going to york and then in july i'm going for a whole week on a boat living on a boat up the river thames so and it's not going to be a narrow boat why do i go like that it's not a narrow boat it's like a piano ferry's cut down it's like a six to eight berth boat it's lovely thanks Dars. <laughs> Honestly, when people subscribe to my YouTube, I get more of a thrill than people sending me gifts because it's like I really do want to get onto YouTube. I really do. That will be cool. Yes, it will be cool, Michael. Honestly, going on a boat, you'll actually, I'll, I'll make sure I do recordings like even of the lock stations and everything else. One of them is like the heartthrob for the girls, I think, and that will be mooring outside, um, mooring in Goring. Try saying that's a mouthful. Mooring and goring. <coughs> and uh, <laughs> I'll give the thanks to us. Um, yeah, I'll be mooring and goring. And I'll be hopefully mooring outside George Michael's house. The house where he passed away. He had several houses. But the one where he passed away, bless him, is in goring. So you can see the front of the house. It's gorgeous. And then when you come round, and I'll show you the back. And we can actually walk past round the back sorry the back of his house is facing the river thames the front of his house we'll walk past and because there's a little graveyard there we lock the door yeah george michael's place yes oh it will be amazing i can't wait to to go there again um there's oh i've forgotten her name i feel so disrespectful the only one who could ever reach me What's the son of a preacher? <laughs> ah, Dusty Springfield. Sorry, I know you had to go through a little bit of trauma there. <laughs> Dusty Springfield is, um, her ashes are actually in Henley, so we'll be going there. Thank you, Julie. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, Dusty Springfield is there. Um, there's a really old, um, I think it's a nunnery in abingdon so we'll be going there as well but there's honestly there's loads of places i'll show you the lock stations and if you're lucky <coughs> you might actually see me falling in <laughs> i haven't fallen in since i was a kid i think i've only fallen in once i've just jinxed that haven't i yeah i've just jinxed that i'm definitely going to be falling in yeah i'm i don't quote me on that one does i don't know 100 percent if it is a nunnery it's oh hang on a minute i've got to do a verification that i'm still here <clears throat> yeah um i don't actually know if it's a nunnery or a monastery I'm pretty sure it's a nunnery if you look it up in abingdon all right just google it i'm going to google actually and find out but it's in it's in abingdon and yeah i can't wait to go there because it's fantastic there's some really old graves in there as well so right <clears throat> well i'm gonna make a go make a move now because the thought of coffee i could do with a nice strong black coffee now with no sugar oh god just the thought of it yeah i need a coffee and i'm also going to do some screenshots but have a look actually have a look at the screenshots that i've pinned because they're amazing <laughs> all right the first one i've pinned it looks like it really does look like a little girl putting her head around the corner and um you can see like uh bunches in her hair and it ponytails and it looks lovely another one is it's a nighttime one um i don't know why that one hasn't got a few thousand views already <clears throat> and that one's got a female voice and it sounds like <clears throat> kind of thing so please have a look at that check that one out okay right yes thank you for everyone joining see julie knows i babylon 
<laughs> I'm going to do some screenshots and have some nice coffees. I'm going. Thank you, everyone, for watching. Thank you for my old followers. Thank you for my new followers. Thank you, everybody. Thank you so much to my moderators as well. And welcome to the family, Does. All right. Sorry I'm late. Typical. <laughs> all right. We'll love to you all. Hope you all have a great day. All right. See you later. Mwah. Bye. <laughs>